as Alabama State home order is set to expire next Tuesday. Local leaders are now putting together plans to reopen businesses while keeping everyone as safe as possible. Joining us this morning on the phone is Lauderdale County Probate Judge Will Motlow. Judge Motlow, thank you so much for joining us this morning. All right, thank you for having me. So, with the last few weeks, Lauderdale County Courthouse has been under uh, restricted as access. Uh, what does that look like, and how has that been going uh, from your viewpoint? Well, it's been going very well, actually. Uh, the, the people of Lauderdale County have been very understanding that, that this is just how we have to do business for a while. Um, and, and essentially, the courthouse lobby, we're open, we're working, we're at the courthouse. Uh, but there's restricted access to get in the building. So only those things that are deemed essential uh, will, will be granted admission to the building. Uh, we're encouraging everyone to, to try to call us to do business by mail, online where it's appropriate. And we also have a drop box set up at the front of the courthouse for, for court filings. Okay. And, and with the state home order set to expire, what can we expect to see moving forward on any uh, policy or procedure changes as the courthouse starts to slowly open up? Well, I, I would say that, that hopefully soon we'll, we'll be able to, to start to get back to normal. Um, but we we'll still have safety measures in place. Uh, we're not going to have any large dockets uh, in the in the near future. Uh, we've already decided not to impanel a jury for the month of May. Uh, we, you know, we're just going to take measures to help us social distance in the in the courthouse and in the courtrooms in particular uh, to, to maybe limit access to so that we can still socially distance. Going forward, we've got the runoff election that's coming up. Uh, there are a few seats out there. Obviously, the big seat is for the Republican side uh, with the Senate seat between Tuberville and Sessions. But you've got some local seats that need to be filled as well out there. How does it look as far as getting folks voting, absentee voting, and getting them in um, to cast their ballots on July 14th? Yeah, well, we're, we're hoping everything goes well. I'm hoping that in July we'll be in a, a better position and that people will be more comfortable and, and comfortable enough to come out and, and cast their vote. Uh, however, absentee voting is already open. So if you would like to request an absentee ballot, you can do that. Uh, it can be mailed to you uh, at this time. So those are, are active and ongoing. And you mentioned that a uh, jury will not be impaneled for the month of May. Is there any thought on when trials will resume moving forward? That decision has not been made yet. Of course, that decision will be up to our presiding circuit judge, Gil Self. Uh, but at this point, the month of May, no jury will be impaneled. June and July will we'll, we'll make that decision as we get closer to time. All right. Lauderdale County Probate Judge Will Motlow, thank you so much for your time this morning. All right. Thank you. All right. Time is 618 now on your Friday morning.